There is little doubt that witches were perceived to be vile beings who could bring misfortune down upon common folk with their gaze alone. The heroes of fairy tales and other yarns, witches entered the folklore of the Nordlings. This is true of one especially, Geralt the Riv, known as the White Wolf. Okay. Um, when we have some quieter moments, I'll tell you a little bit more, uh, a little bit more about myself. Um, pick up. But basically, um, I am a university student. I play the video games for fun, and I do this YouTube channel as sort of a hobby. Um, this guy's doing some training. Uh, and you'll find out more about me the more we hang out uh, and chill and play this video game. But, uh, yeah, let's go head up to the king and see what it is that he wants with us and see where this army is going. A beautiful day for battle. Fear not, Excellency, we're out of range of their arbalists. I am no warrior, sir. I must admit, I prefer to joust verbal. Finally! Traitors of the realm boil tar on the walls while you dally with the royal advisor. How may I assist you, sire? We mount an assault today, and you'll be at my side. Follow me, gentlemen. Let's not keep the traitors waiting. Oop. Sire, you said we were out of range. That was a ballista, Excellency. Its arms strengthened with bronze plates and strung with horsehair. It can propel heavy bolts up to a mile away. A deadly and very costly weapon. An experienced crew can cock and release two bolts each minute. Yet it has one flaw. Your Grace, please take cover. The recoil of the arms is so strong upon firing that the weapon shifts. It simply cannot hit the same spot twice. I had no idea your grace was a learned military engineer. I'm not. I gave the Baroness those ballistae two years ago for her birthday. Hmm. <laughs> so, so. What say you, Excellency, of men who live in spite of such wounds? And what say you, Your Grace, of soldiers who inflict them? Those who did this live no more. I should hope not. Jesus. That's... God. Master Geralt, I wish to converse with you once the storm of battle has subsided. Forgive me, Excellency, but I plan to leave the Royal Court as soon as possible. Might I know why? Too often they take me for someone I'm not. What do they call you, soldier? Wait. You served with me at Brenner and during our foray into the Pontar Valley. Norman Sador. Still an arbalist? Yes, sir. Fight has not been kind to me. Ha! <laughs> Norman Sador, for your years of faithful service to the Crown, I appoint you Decurion of the Arbalists. Onwards, gentlemen. No reason to dawdle. I... I'm not dawdling. You, sir, are dawdling. It gives us a quick ballista lesson for some reason. Forgive my candor, Your Majesty, but uh, I must ask, what fate awaits the royal bastards when they're my children? If I hear bastard one more time, someone will die painfully. Your Grace, forgive me. But the laws of succession are irrefutably clear. Piss on the laws. I'll change them if need be. Yeah, he's a king. Above all, I'll not allow a band of treacherous barons to use my children as their banner. Your Majesty is entirely within his rights. Adder is dead, and I have no other children. I see. This conversation is over, Excellency. Please retire to your tent. Yeah, we gotta go. We gotta go kill some bitches. You know what I'm saying? Black ones in my camp before a battle. What has the world come to? Nothing would make me happier than returning his shriveled head to Emir in a sack. But Triss Merigold insisted I be patient and courteous. Was I? Uh, uh, as ever. I couldn't have handled it better myself. Ha! I always knew you were one of us. And bugger what folks say. They talked about Adder no end. Have you learned anything about the assassin? Nothing new. Nothing new, sire. Life. A month's passed, and we don't know any more than we knew when we began. 
this investigation's going nowhere. My agents have learned little also. But we'll find the culprits, it's just a question of time. Now, for the battle. I want you at my side today. Then you may go where you please. Thank you, sire. Where are you aiming, imbeciles? Soldier! Spyglass! What is going on up there? The gods! Count at your belly! Catch, Witcher! Aim for the rogue with the red plume. Not six months ago, he swore eternal friendship to me. Quickly! How much higher? Two and a half degrees. Oh, what's up? Did we hit the bastard? He ducked. <laughs> Damn it. We'll get him on the walls. Follow me, Witcher. Let's bounce. Let's splizzity split. Alright, so. This big tower thing, for some reason. Let's get on top of the walls, basically. They have them in Lord of the Rings. No, I believe. You know, Witcher, I'm prepared to forgive Louisa. All she need do is to kneel before her king. Very noble of you. Are you mocking me? <laughs> Never mind. I'm certain Louisa will realize her mistakes. Besides, children should have a mother. I'm lost. It's quite simple. Louisa and I had a bit of a tiff. She made demands I could not fulfill. Understand? I think so. Count Echeverry and others immediately intervened, all noble, all sympathetic. They claimed the evil king would take her children, but they would protect them, even place them on the throne. And the Baroness was duped. A motherly Ready love you. In truth, they desire privileges that would weaken the throne. In a bandage brick in a sling. That's a swiving soldier's life. Taking orders, smash your foe. Coin and country, there your wife. Someone and a long road at your toe. All right, let's keep going up. Climbing many ladders, walking on those glutes. Oh, jeez. That was a blister. Look alive, man! I'm still not really dressed for battle. I hope the game puts some, put some armor on us at some point. Just Where the jacket. hell are we headed? <laughs> what the fuck do we want? This, this I like! Okay. Eyes on the bridge! We're nearly there! Weapons at the ready! What's happening? Oh. That tower was ridiculous. It was designed to break the rebels' morale. A bunch of lords and lordlings took a ride to then pompously stride on top of the walls, while the real army fought and died below them in the shit and piss-filled streets. If years of service have taught me anything, it's that the highborn don the best costumes and get the best vantage points, whether at a ball or in battle. But it's not the time for that kind of jousting, Witcher. Continue your story. Okay. I will do the assault. Things went relatively smoothly after we came out of that tower. That is, until we ran into Aryan Lavalette. Lavalette? Uh, the Lavalettes are the people who own this castle, I believe. Oh, we have Almond, I think. I've got a badass hood, too. Looking some, looking some baller mofo with this hood on, yo. Oh, get dead. Oh, jeez. Ugh. Oh, fuck. Oh, God. Okay. Violence. Violence immediately. These look kind of cool, though. Watch out! 
the tyrant! Death to Voltaire! Better, Nike! They're traitors! Take no prisoners! Lord Suxon, you shall push for the center aisle and bring down that gate. It's a good day to kill, Your Majesty. Mm. Follow me, gentlemen. I don't know if it's ever a good day Fort to kill. Tameria. Seems like kind of contradiction in terms. Lord Swan, you and your men shall follow me. We must capture or otherwise deal with Arian Lavalette in order to break the defenders' morale. Yes, Your Grace. Geralt, gentlemen, follow me for the glory. Okay, settle down. Big boy, he's getting all excited. Gotta get through that town, though. Fall back, God damn it! I forbid you to die like imbeciles. Hear me! That's a lot They're of arrows. They're taking a good position, the bastards. If this persists, they'll pick us off like ducks. And I'm no duck. Any ideas? That ballista would do the trick. Defeat the ballista's defenders and prepare to launch a bolt. Okay. Let's go down here. And we'll hop and grab this loot bag. Pop down here. Boop. And down again. Boop. There's no free climbing in this game, I don't think. Kill the Witcher! There is little doubt that witches were perceived to be vile beings who could bring misfortune down upon common folk with their gaze alone. The heroes of fairy tales and other yarns, witches entered the folklore of the Nordlings. This is true of one especially, Geralt the Riv, known as the White Wolf.